Okay, now that that's dry, I'm going to attempt to put some little, kind of like a bottom foliage on the on that background area. I'm kind of just brush mixing some color. And so I'm going to come in here and just squash on. I just double loaded some of the green and a yellow just so that the yellow gave a little bit of a highlight on the green that was there. And that'll just kind of take care of the rest of that background area. Now, I want to take a little bit of that same brown that I used within this, but full strength, and create a little more shading within that. And we're just going to pretend that looks like a plowed field that maybe hasn't been planted yet or something. That's what I like to think of it as anyway. Okay, now we're going to, with another little bit of a double load on the brush, we're going to create some foliage for the foreground. And this dark layer will kind of push the the barn part back in the painting. So now I want to take and we're going to put a little fence here. So I've got my brown color for my fence posts. And all I did was took some burnt sienna and put a little bit of black in it to make it a little darker. And then I'm going to take and touch into a little bit of white to come back and add the highlight on the fence posts. Okay, and let the fence post dry, and I'll come back and show you how I finish it off.